you guys so it is a first day of p.m. 2 but it is early morning so I take night classes so right now I'm dressed I'm about to go to Macy's to do my orientation or whatever this is I don't even know simply orange it's good for you um all right so I'm just having me some breakfast, some orange juice, and a cinnamon raisin a bagel. Oh my god, they're so good. Toasted with some butter or strawberry jelly. Strawberry jelly is what I'm having today, okay? <laughs> Alright, but I sent my friends a little Snapchat. Well, they're, they're not on my Snapchat, but I sent them like, I made the video on Snapchat and then Snapchat, Snapchat. And then I sent it to them, just saying like, have a good day. I'll post it. I'll insert it here. Right here, insert. Good morning, you guys. I wish you guys were on my Snapchat, then I could just send this as a message, but I can't. So, have a good day. I'm so sad that we're all like split up, but we're gonna be amazing. So, have a good day, you guys. Let me know how it goes. Okay. Mwah. Okay, you guys, so, yes, yeah, so I'm about to go, and I will um, see you guys later um, once I'm um, at the new clinical site, and I'll show you guys what, the, what it looks like. Pretty sure I can't film inside, but I'll show you guys outside and everything like that. But this is such an exciting day. It's crazy. It's it's overwhelming. It's stressful. It's all of the above, okay? Going into a PN2, counting down to graduation, and then starting work too while I'm in nursing school, which I did not want to do. But, um, you know, life happens, so. Yeah, but I'll see you guys later. Bye. Hey guys. So I just left the new facility and I freaking love it. I love my new clinical instructor. She is so nice. And she's like, don't be afraid to ask questions, which I love because y'all know that old instructor. Okay. <laughs> so glad we're out of that environment. It just feels so good. Like it's such a fresh start and I'm like completely loving it. Like it's only, we were only there until, what is it? Six o'clock. So, and we don't have to be there until 4.15 because she has, she works for another college as well and she um, has a job as well. She's a nursing supervisor somewhere else. So, yes, I'm loving it because that way I can get out of work at 2 o'clock, get the kids and not feel like super rushed. And it's literally like maybe 10, depending on traffic, it's like 10, 12 minutes away from my house. So, that's fine. But yeah, you guys, good first day. I'm so excited. So I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm here at Walmart. I need to go get the stuff for Josiah's birthday cake. His birthday is tomorrow. He's turning six. So I'll insert a picture here of his cake. He wants a Batman cake, so that's what I'm doing. All right, so let me go get this stuff because I really got stuff. Hey, I got stuff. All right, let me go get this stuff and get home. Okay, bye. Hey, you guys. So it's Tuesday. I'm at work. I have like 20 minutes. I have 20 minutes before I start. So, but I'm in the home section and the Martha Stewart section. Everything is so nice. I feel like I'm about to be broke. Like, I'm going to pay my bills, but <laughs> I'm about to go shopping, okay? But yeah, you guys, it's Tuesday, so... I'm just checking in on my weekly vlogging for you guys, but it's some really good sales right now at Macy's, so super exciting, but you guys, I will see you guys later with a recap of my day after clinicals. Bye. Hey guys, so it's Wednesday night. All right, so I just got out of my first PN2 theory lecture class, whatever you guys want to call it, theory lecture um but i love it oh my gosh so we of course are in med surge and um we are doing the surgical patient that's the first chapter we are doing so we're lear learning everything about preoperative um that's what it's called right preoperative so it's the preoperative um intra and then postoperative so we just finished preoperative um we're into oh we're into intro we did that and then we um talked about like the patients going to the PACU 
and um now we're in post-operative so very 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 good lecture i love the clinical instructor there's two clinical instructor the theory instructor there's two theory instructors um so one will teach the first three lectures the next will teach teach three lectures so they go three weeks three weeks you know rotate like that um but the first one so far so freaking good she is really really good actually um what else Oh, so yesterday in clinicals, my patient was a total hip replacement. So I got to um, check on the wound incision and irrigate the wound. And um, so I had to irrigate it with normal saline and then use a ABD, sterile ABD, to basically cover it up after I was done. And then we did just a regular um, cream that she needed um as a treatment and then i did oh skin prep so that was it so the cream and skin prep we had already been doing that but the irrigating of the wound for the um the hip replacement i was so i was nervous but the clinical instructor again i love her as well so freaking nice like she just was like okay you know this is what you do so she told me what to do i did it and she's like oh you did such a great job and it's uh, like such a relief to be able to actually like talk to your instructors and for them to reassure you like we are here to help you pass okay um like the um theory instructor today she was just telling us how like the way she is going to what the heck i don't even know what i'm pressing on here the way she's gonna the test are it's basically in class questions because they're preparing us for the next six months to take our boards so I'm super excited about that, you guys. So tomorrow we're going to finish surgical patient. We're going to do some test questions, which is NCLEX questions. Um, and then we're going to go over, I think we have math review tomorrow. But they literally gave us our whole schedule for the next six months. So super excited about that. But I will see you guys tomorrow. I'm going to go in here and start reading this chapter. And um, yeah, get my life. Hey guys, so it's Thursday night, so I'm gonna wrap up this week's vlog. Um, I decided to talk to you guys while I'm about to eat my food. Let me show y'all my food. It looks so Look good. It's this Mediterranean place near my school. Woo, I didn't know how to pronounce this, but all my nursing friends tried it yesterday and they're like, you gotta taste this. So it's like chicken, potatoes, onions, cucumbers, whatever, but. Uh about to be bomb with that feta cheese on there and some kind of sauce right here all right you guys so yeah so just to recap for the week so this is our first week of pn2 um learned a lot a lot a lot of stuff in theory yesterday and today um so super excited and nervous about our first test next week um but yes yeah, the first test of course we're going to be nervous and, and all that stuff but um i feel like as long as i study like i got this but of course it's completely different than pn1 there's no study guides there's no whatever but the um instructor she is very thorough and she gives us plenty of examples to go by and to actually understand the material so i think that made it a way better lecture and um easier to take notes and things like that but yeah you guys so um i will see you guys next week so um yeah i think i told you guys everything that happened like throughout the video but so far pn2 i'm loving it i'm loving it i love the instructors that i have and um i'm looking forward to a great amazing informative learning experience for the next six months and um yeah and they keep on saying six months is right around the corner you guys are graduating in april like it's really so close like it's so crazy but yeah, you guys, so I will see you guys next week. And um, I'm excited to do new cool things in clinical and um, see how this first test goes. So the way it works is going to be 50 questions for med surge. And then there's 10, a separate 10 question pharmacology test. So these are the drugs that go with this chapter. So there's 18 drugs, but there, we're only going to test. There's only going to be 10 questions. So we have to know all 18 just in case it's asked on the test, of course. And then we have our first math test. So the way that PN2 works, if you pass the first two math tests with a 90% or higher, then you don't have to take the other two math tests. So that is the goal. I'm trying to just pass the first two with a 90 and then be done with math so I, I don't have to worry about 
that and I can focus on just the med surge part of it. And then the OB and pediatrics comes at the end. We have to do a project um, for pediatrics. So super, super excited about the, the next six months, you guys. It's going to be great. Great, great. This is a great week for transition. I loved it. I love how smooth they made everything go. But yeah, you guys, so I will see you guys next week. And um, yeah, if you guys haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And uh, talk to you later. Bye.